Welcome folks, I'm Shabit Tawfiq. Welcome again on this new series How to create a Joyride Jetpack using the Unity 5 game engine uh, Here we are going to create a new game in the 2D platform using the Unity 5 game engine introduced by the Unity company So we are going to create a new project New project Okay, file, a new project. We are going to work with the, uh, are going to name it as uh, Joyride Jetpack. So uh, make sure that uh, we are going to work with the 2D platform. We are going, uh, are not using any assets package uh, of the union introduced by the unity so it's a 2d create project as you can see there is a, a new graphics new interface introduced in the unity 5 so uh, make sure that there is a 2 uh, a 2d uh, here if uh, it's a 3D, you can go to the edit, project setting, editors, and make sure that the default behavior mode is 2D, not 3D. Uh, so, we are going to create a new folder. Create a new folder. Scene. And we are going to save our scene. Save scene. Scene one. And the scene folder. Save. Now we are going to uh, configure our game view. So we go to the game. We are going to add uh, a new uh, a new uh, aspect so uh, I found landscape we are going to use the okay great uh, make sure that the camera uh, and the X, Y, Z is zero, zero, zero. And make sure that the projection is uh, projection mode is orthographic, not the perspective. Great. Uh, now uh, make sure uh, that the size is 3.2. Great, because it's going to be a game for uh, uh, the iPhone landscape resolution. Now we are going to upload our sprites. Sprites audio. Just uh, select the two folder and drag them to the Unity folder. Hold on, uh, just a few seconds. Then we can use it. Great. Now uh, our uh, sprites and our audio are ready to use. Uh, go to the sprite folder. Now we are going to add our new player to the scene. Sprites, uh, mouse fly, and uh, select it and drag it to our scene. You can press F for focus. Focus, F. Uh, we are uh, make sure that it is on the x zero y zero and z zero. So the camera will be with our player. Uh, we are going to add a circle collider component physics to the circle collider, or you can add it from here component. Physics to the circle collider. It's the same. Uh, radius, set the radius to 0, 5. 
and add component physics 2D rigid body 2D. Make sure that the fixed angle uh, is enabled. Is enabled. Okay. That's uh, all for uh, this tutorial. In the next tutorial, we are going to create a script to control uh, the, our player. If we hit the play button, Oops, there he is. So when we test our game, we see our player falling because we have applied our 2D rigid body. Thank you so much. In the next tutorial, we are going to create a script to control our jetpack. Thank you.